Hello everybody, my name is Jeremy and this is Chris. We're with the Boathouse Group. Today we're on a 2022 Everglades 365. In this video, we're gonna be showing you how to set up your full rigging kit on your outrigger poles. On this specific boat, we have the Gemlux carbon fiber outriggers and we're gonna have the double rigging kit. So follow us along and we'll show you how to put this all together. All right, so the first process is to take your outrigger wire that Gemlux provides in the double rigging kit and you're gonna run the long one first, which is gonna be your outside. So you're gonna run it through the three rollers that they have on your outrigger. Then we'll go ahead and extend that outrigger pole out. Once you've fully extended your outrigger, then you're gonna to wanna to flip it over to the side like you'd have it out while you're using it while trolling. At this point in time, you can take your long end, the, the part that went through the end of the outrigger and then back to you, and you're gonna have a couple pieces you're gonna to attach to it from there. First, you're gonna use your stopper. What this does is stops the clip from going up and through the outrigger. So you'll slide that on forward. Next step, you have your little crimp. You'll feed your crimp onto there, and then you have your swivel with your clip that you'll put on there from there. At that point in time, you'll make a little bit of a loop back into the crimp and then out the other side. When you have that set up, you are gonna wanna leave a little bit of slack like you see there, just so this has room to move around. It's not gonna get chewed up over time. And then from there, we're gonna take this and crimp this in three different locations. So now that we got your, the far end set up, the next step is gonna be running it through the boat side and then back out towards the end of the outrigger. When you order the kit through Gemlux, they get you plenty of extra cable to set up your outriggers. So just cut it with a little bit of extra slack so you have room to work with and then feed it and then trim it to size. So we're gonna go ahead and do that here. Just get a piece here. So then once you have this piece cut, you're gonna go ahead and run it through the end of what's called the halyard. These are Gemlux specific halyards. There is a short end and a fat end, they call them. This particular piece is gonna run through what's called the short end. Now the double kit comes with two halyards. These are specific to which side you run. So the longer side is gonna to have to go through the back halyard like so. So now that we got all that ran through, now we're gonna pretty much set up the other side exactly like that. First off, I'm gonna take your clip that you're gonna run your line through while you're fishing, hook it on this side. And then with the other side on the boat side, again, the same process, we're gonna run through this. We're gonna go crimp, swivel with the clip, back into crimp. The only difference being on this side that you're not gonna have that stopper ball. The stopper ball only goes on the outward side of the outrigger assembly. And then from there, you're gonna to wanna to clip these together so now you can get your tension on the outrigger. So now the first setup is done. This is again, that is your longer outrigger line. Next up, we're gonna do the shorter outrigger line for the double setup. And this one's just gonna go through the rollers on the first and second location. The third location is just a single roller, just for the longer line. So again, on this one, we're just gonna feed them through those two, do the exact same procedures by putting the clips on there, crimping both sides, and adjusting then for size. Now this Everglades 365 comes equipped with the Gemlux cam lock. This feature is nice in that it allows your outriggers to be adjustable. So to loosen it, all you're gonna do is release on the cam lock at the bottom side and the paracord releases. And to tighten it, you would just release that cam lock, pull downward, and it locks into place. Another awesome product from Gemlux is their sea sucker setup here. The nice part about that is you can mount this in any different location and to hook up to your outriggers. I like it that I can hook it up to the windshield. If I wanna get it out of the way, hook it up to the outside of the boat somewhere. If I'm running the boat and just storing the outriggers, I can hook it up to the underside of the T-top, top side of the T-top, just makes it so it's very, very versatile versus always having to go to the one location on the side of the boat. So again, that is the Gemlux product in incorporation with Sea Sucker. 
once you finish rigging that second setup on the outrigger, then you can go ahead and repeat the exact same process on the other side. Once you've completed that, the boat is completely set up with outriggers and you're ready to go out and go fishing. If you have any questions about this process, any boats that we offer, any accessories or different equipment to outfit your boat, feel free to reach out to any one of us, stop by any of our three locations here in Southwest Florida, or just give us a call. We would look forward to hearing from you and thank you very much for watching. Thanks guys.